can't find faith and I'm sick of trying. I hate the way that I look. I have OCD and it's ruining my life. I'm gay. So what happened with your mom? I told her I wasn't going to church anymore. She tried telling me that I needed faith now more than ever. Like a stupid little service would help me to get over my dad. It's normal to question your faith. But I'm not questioning it anymore. I feel like there's no point to this. But I think- I'm not comfortable talking about this with you. I'll meet you in the car. God bless you. You too. Ryan, are you wearing makeup? What? Are, are you wearing makeup on your face? No, I just have a sunburn. It looks like you got toothpaste on your face. Hey man, your skin looks fine, don't worry about it. Seriously. There will be zero tolerance for any disruptions throughout the duration of this test. If there are any disruptions, I will be forced to take up your unfinished test. You will be asked to leave the testing center and your score will be canceled. If there are no more questions, you may begin. I know about you too. Why didn't you just tell me? I know you're gay. Everyone knows you're gay. Just accept it. Everyone already knows. Why can't you accept it? It's okay. This is good for us. It's what we've wanted for a long time. You just don't get it. I can't do this anymore.
Hello everyone, welcome to Group. Hardship is normal. We all have our own issues, and it's easy to think we're alone in these problems. We aren't. We all have our own guardian angel, somewhere just waiting to be found. It could be in the form of a friend, test administrator, substitute teacher, homeless man, or even a therapist. I have witnessed each and every one of your hardships, and I promise you that we are all more linked than you realize. Now, who's ready for some therapy? I'll go first. <laughs>